The holiday season is quickly approaching and uh, as expected, it looks like Fortnite's got some really crazy tricks up their sleeves, some big events coming to the game. And uh, that's exactly what we're going to be talking about here in this video. So we've got a potential new movie crossover happening, which was just leaked a few minutes ago, which uh, I think sounds pretty cool, as well as an in-game event that uh, some of you guys may have seen people talking about. It's on the horizon right there, but I didn't get a chance to make a video on that yet. So well, we've got kind of a double duty video here. So first of all, let's talk about this movie crossover. So I'm sure you guys remember a couple months ago, we had the Avengers Infinity War, Infinity Gauntlet, Thanos, type, you know, thing that went down, the LTM and everything. It was honestly so cool. One of the best LTMs we have ever had in this game. A lot of people want to see that come back. So far, there's really no, you know, sign of it coming back at this point. I mean, we did have an updated emblem a couple weeks ago, but that didn't really lead to anything. So I don't think that's going to be coming back, but we may be getting a brand new movie crossover promotion type thing happening with Wreck-It Ralph. So Wreck-It Ralph 2 just came out today, brand new movie, and uh, it just so happens that with that movie coming out, there was a new file added to the Fortnite files. So this was discovered by the little YH on Twitter. You guys can see, he says he found this short video in Program Files, Epic Games, Fortnite, Fortnite, Fortnite Game, Content, Movies, and Promotions. So it was in that file strand. And this is the video that he found. So you guys can see it's Ralph running through, kind of like celebrating or being happy or whatever. And um, very odd, right? So keep in mind that none of this is confirmed. This has not been, you know, talked about by Epic or anything like that. But I would imagine that, you know, adding something like this into a promotions folder means there's going to be some sort of a Wreck-It Ralph promotion coming soon. And uh, I'm not going to lie. Like the, the Avengers crossover was really really cool i loved that honestly wreck it ralph is really good like if you haven't seen the movie i could totally see you thinking like oh that's just like a super kitty you know disney movie type deal but like the first one was a fantastic movie i haven't had the chance to see the second one yet i might try to go see it with chelsea soon but the first movie was absolutely fantastic so like i could see a pretty cool ltm coming out of this Wreck-It Ralph promotion if this ends up happening. And obviously, I mean, Wreck-It Ralph is based off of a video game. It was like a, an old school, you know, 2D style destruction type game. So who knows what they could do with that? I mean, are we going to be like teaming up to try to do the most damage together across the map? Or like what, what would make it special? Like Thanos, it gave you the Infinity Gauntlet. So you had those extra powers. What would you gain with... Wreck-It Ralph abilities or powers or anything. I have no clue, but uh, it sounds like it could be kind of interesting. So we'll have to wait and see what happens with that. By the way, this is my first time ever using dynamite. So we're gonna, we're gonna test this out real quick. I haven't, I didn't get a chance to use it yesterday because it was taken out so quickly. So we're... <laughs> Dude, that is, that is absolutely ridiculous. I love it. Now, the other thing I want to talk about is over here on the horizon so i was hoping to grab a sniper rifle we weren't able to get one but we do have the hunting rifle here it allows us to zoom in a little bit you guys can see we have got a cloud on the horizon out there and uh it's mysterious it showed up in game i want to say like 36 hours ago or so it was you know, a little bit over a day ago and uh, you guys can see there's no other clouds on the horizon anywhere else like this this is a unique thing it was just added into the game it was not there before and a lot of people think that this is a snowstorm coming in for season seven of Fortnite. And to, honestly, I feel like that's what it has to be. I, I can't think of any other explanation. I think this is kind of like the start of the season seven celebration, event, whatever you want to call it. I mean, we're pretty deep into season six so far. I feel like it kind of flew by. And uh, obviously they need a couple of weeks to build it up and kind of build a story and have things start to happen. So keep an eye on this, uh, this storm as it comes into the map. I've got a feeling over the course of the next few days and week or so, it's going to start getting bigger. Things are going to start happening and we should have a pretty cool transition to season seven. Because really apart from that, 
I can't think of anything else they would do. I mean, season seven is going to be like the, the holiday type season, you know what I mean? So it totally makes sense. And on top of that, we've had other kind of little teasers here and there. So we had the new aim skin for completing seven weeks of challenges. You guys have noticed it's a robot skin, but it's got frozen feet and hands. Uh, also, the, uh, the Fortnite retail copy came out and the skin you get with that is like a frozen Arctic skin. They had a promo image right here, which obviously shows him like climbing a snowy mountain. So, you know, everything is kind of pointing towards we could be getting snow, which could be kind of cool. Obviously, last year with the, the holiday season, we got like the Christmas lights and decorations everywhere, the Christmas trees, the presents, the, the Christmas tree bushes and stuff like that. But we didn't actually get snow on the ground in BR. We got it and saved the world, but not in BR. And I'm, I'm really hoping that we have like a snow covered wintry wonderland this year and, and like, you know, ice all over the place and like Loot Lake or Leaky Lake turns to ice and you can like ice skate around and stuff like that. I feel like they're going to take it to the next level this year. So, well, we'll have to wait and see what happens. But uh, yeah, definitely keep an eye on the horizon. That is most definitely a new storm that's a brewing. And uh, we're going to have to wait and see what comes of it. But anyway, yeah, there you guys have it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Just to give you guys a little update. Potential Wreck-It Ralph crossover. I wouldn't be surprised if they announced that sometime in the next, like, 24 hours or 36 hours or so, if, if it's actually going to happen. And uh, then also... We should be having a, a really cool uh, Christmas event going on, winter event going on this year. So thank you guys so much for watching. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already. Peace out.